It takes a team to put a news report together, and our photographers are always looking for the best shots. Channel 5 photojournalist Juan Anteldua shows us his creative side and tonight's photographer's perspective. For today's photographer's perspective, I'm going to talk about shooting creative video. Whether you're in the middle of a field, in the middle of the road, in a city or a ranch, border towns or downtowns, shooting creative video is shooting video that looks different, different from any other news story out there. And also the imagery needs to work well with the story. The idea is to be informative and creative at the same time, but it also depends on the intention and what you're trying to say with your images. For instance here, we were trying to do different shots and see how that looked using a camera slider or a dolly which is a wheel card where you mount the camera and it's used to create smooth horizontal or circular camera movements then I try to replicate a shot I've seen in movies called dolly zoom shot also referred to as the vertigo effect or a solly shot an effect which was first conceived for the film vertigo we tried this a few times is a technique where the camera is dollied either forward or backward while the zoom on the lens is pulled in the opposite direction. It's a cinematic technique in which the camera moves closer or further from the subject while adjusting the zoom angle to keep the subject in the same size in the frame. The effect is that the subject appears stationary while the background size changes. This is called perspective distortion. At the end, we just did a simple dolly shot and this is what ended up in the final product. A combination of factors, camera placement, angles, focal length, steady shot or movement. The goal is to produce unique shots designed to invoke a feeling and make you remember it well. That's where creative use of the camera comes in. Something to make it iconic, memorable, and always work for the service of the story. It's great to have a visual reference when it comes to compose your shot. Could be images that stick in your mind, movies, videos, or whatever's around you. Nowadays we have access to endless amount of content over the internet and television. So we have an infinite resource of visual material that can help us find and shape our vision for visual storytelling. Just be on the lookout for images and moments that you would like to capture and material that fits according to the story. Each and every moment of every story is important and always try to leave our viewers with beautiful, creative and compelling images that go hand in hand with the story. Ride-alongs are the perfect example in my case, I try to put the camera on every position available. Just like in the movies or TV shows, we transport our viewers to the exact location and show them exactly how it is to be in the police unit. Every single moment, every angle, and point of view it's important so the viewer could be completely immersed and invested in the story. For my photographer's perspective, I'm Juan Ansaldua, Channel 5 News, Sunday at 10.30.